Yes. What excited you most about being part of the virtual TT? It is something I've never played before, and the realism of it um, was incredible. Uh, I didn't even know the amount of bugs you'll get on the helmet as well as the windscreen that when you're going around the track. Um, the attention to details on um, the crowds as well as the trees and the, um, I guess, the grasslands are just incredible. Uh, which part of the virtual track was the hardest to master? I'm pretty sure they all have names, all the corners have names, but the most difficult thing for me was the really sharp U-turn going up the hill. Um, I think there was only maybe two or three times where I remembered that corner was coming up and actually slowed it up, slowed down enough. Um, the rest of them, like you've just seen, um, was just, oh my God, the corner's coming up. Forgot about that. And then I just crash. Um, and then there is the, this other tricky bit, which I always forget, the bit that sends you flying right by the pub and you have to slow right down. Yeah. The road looks really straight on the map, but... Mm -hmm. It doesn't you tell you slow. gonna about yeah exactly. Uh, did you know anything about the Isle of Man TT before you got involved with this project? No, I've never heard of the Isle of Man TT before this project. Um, I think I, I really don't know how the riders do it. The laps are so incredibly long, and having to concentrate for um, one lap is crazy. But I think some people do four or four or six laps when i was uh, researching it and that is just impressive on a different level mm -hmm. and finally now you have completed the course on the game and seen the speeds that they can go what do you think about the riders that do this every year on the real track i think it is absolutely incredible um just going at those speeds on a straight line i think I can only imagine it's absolutely terrifying. Um, I don't, and I don't think I'm going to give it a go myself anytime soon. Um, and doing this every year and laps and laps of that, it's something I can't, can't describe how impressive that is really.